With Monster Hunter Double Cross now available in Japan, and after playing it for a little while, I've realized there's a plentiful amount of armor sets available in G-Rank now. While this is a fantastic thing for game duration, there's a myriad of information to pass, and it can be a little difficult to choose what full sets are good and for what purpose. This video series I hope will be able to alleviate this somewhat by detailing what full armor sets give in terms of their slots, defense, resistances, armor skills, as well as the annoying parts to obtain in each set, as there's always a couple of them. Each one of these videos should only be a couple of minutes long, but be jam-packed with all the info you need to decide whether the armor's for you or not. Keep in mind with Double Cross, any set's useful now thanks to Transmog, so keep an eye out on the designs as well. On that note, let's get to it! The Chain Blade Master armor is one of the first and easiest sets to make in G-Rank, giving you 78 defense per part, maxing out at 120, and a total of 5 lightning resistance. Set's got 8 slots, 1 triple, and 1 double slotted piece. When it's fully equipped, you're going to have Health plus 20 and Rational. The parts required for the set are 15 Dragonite or 14 Carbolite or 9 Elterlite or 6 Union or 3 King Scarabs and 3 Ice Crystals to top it off. The set doesn't really have any tricky parts, just mine and gather in G-Rank as well as high rank and you'll be there in no time. In terms of usable parts for mixed sets, the leg giving plus 5 health is about the best you're going to get out of this, or if you really need a triple slot badly, you can use the headpiece. The set's really only going to be useful if you're key grinding your way through the game and need an easy to acquire set in early G-Rank to stay alive with the increased damage that monsters do. It's easy enough to gem in health plus 50 as you may not have ingredients yet, and with the right weapon or charm has space to get an attack style up benefits if you're going for quick clears. Upgrading it's not particularly hard either, just use the spheres you'll get by playing the game and mining as before, allowing the set to push through a little more of that key grind. Otherwise, however, if unless you like the look of the set, you can pretty much give this set an entire skip. Want to know more about an armor set? Let us know in the comments or in the other ways I use for social media. And of course, my friends, happy hunting.